This is a USB aroma dish, which you're supposed to put some water and oils in, or maybe just the oils on their own, and it warms up. But being USB powered, it's currently drawing 420 milliamps at about 4.7 volts. So let's do the maths here. 4.7 volts times uh, 0.42 equals, so it's around about 2 watts output, which isn't very high. And it, it doesn't seem to regulate in any way, it just runs at a fixed temperature, suggesting it might just be a resistor under here. And um, it doesn't get that hot. I have to say, it, uh, compared to ambient, it gets up to about 17 degrees centigrade above ambient, so um, I'm not really sure. I'm guessing it's just a resistor inside, so let's unplug it and uh, open it up. I'm guessing there are screws under these. Yes, there are. Ugh. Not sure they'll be going back in again. I originally got this because I was playing about with the mains powered um, the oil and wax burners and I thought maybe I could reuse this dish, particularly if it's not stainless steel because then I can solder an earth onto it. So I've exposed four screws. There's also a little recessed neon indicator on this, the, the neon LED indicator just behind the uh, front, but it's barely visible, it's only really visible in a dark room. And there's an on-off switch at the back. I'm expecting in this a resistor just a fixed resistor. I should do the mass for that, shouldn't I? It was roughly about uh, 400 milliamps, um, so let's say R equals V, say 5, divided by 0.4 12 ohm resistor. Plus maybe a small resistor for the LED. There's a lot in there. Capacitors. Big resistors at the side that aren't actually heating it, and this is the heating bit here. With one, two, three, four wires. What on earth is that about? Oh, and the dish just comes off too. Those screws that held the base on also hold the dish in. Oh, it's covered in transistors. What on earth is this doing? Is it voltage regulation? Is it actually sensing temperature? Given that it doesn't really get very hot, I wouldn't think it would be even making an attempt to sense temperature. R plus R minus, that's presumably a resistor. So is there a temperature sensor? Let's open it up and find out. This is, just seems way too complicated. Oh, it's got two resistors, one at each end, and foam, and there's a diode type device which I'm guessing is a thermistor in the middle. How odd! So it is making some sort of attempt to thermally regulate it, even though it doesn't really get that hot in the first place. 
Ooh. Hmm. I get the feeling I may just be making some modifications to this, which are going to make it a lot simpler. I'm going to get rid of all that circuitry. Yeah, the resistors are just in parallel on that, and then there's the temperature sensor, presumably. Oh, that just seems so complicated, it's almost strange. Four transistors. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine resistors. Surface mount capacitor, little diode tacked on, couple of electrolytics. Resistor here, what is this all about? Yeah, I think I, I think I may experiment with this. This could be quite uh, enjoyable. I wonder why it's so complicated. That's just weird. Yes, an interesting wee device. I think I'll, uh, I think I'll be playing about with that a wee bit.